Clothings, having clothings that have pictures on it. Okay? Pictures of people's faces and all of that. A large number of scholars from the Madhab al-Shafi'iyya and the Hanabila and also the Hanafiyya and it's also the opinion that Shaykh al-Islam ibn Taymiyyah chose and Muhammad ibn Ali Shawkani and ibn Baz and ibn Uthaymin and others is that it's impermissible for you to wear clothing that has what? Pictures on it. Okay? It's pictures not like and, uh, pictures of uh, flowers and trees and all of that's fine. But we're talking about living things. We're talking about pictures of human beings, animals and things like that. Those great scholars and those imams in Islam, they mentioned that it's what? It's prohibited. And they based it on a few number of hadiths. Zayd ibn Khalid in al-Juhani radiallahu anhu, he said, إن أبا طلحة حدثه أن النبي صلى الله عليه وسلم قال لا تدخل الملائكة بيتا فيه صورة. The angels do not enter a house where there is what pictures. So they use this as evidence, and they also even used the Prophet صلى الله عليه وسلم when he saw a curtain that had pictures on it. He requested for عائشة رضي الله عنها to what to remove it. So from that, some scholars they took the impermissibility of wearing clothing that has what. Pictures on it. What about clothing that has pictures of trees, for example, and the moon, for example, and the mountains? And by unanimous agreement of the scholars, all of them, the Hanafiya and the Malikiya and the Shafi'iya and the Hanabila, by unanimous agreement, they all agree that it's what? It is permissible for you to wear those clothes, a type of clothes. If it's got trees and moon and stars and all of that, it's permissible. There's nothing wrong with that. Also, clothing that has symbols of disbelief on it, like having clo- wearing clothes that has the what? Christian sign, for example. You're not allowed to wear clothing that has those, it's called the salib, the Christian sign. You're not allowed to have that. And it is haram, and the Prophet sallallahu prohibited it. And a lot of our youngsters need to go back to a lot of the uh, team and is, they support okay the football teams that you support be careful sometimes there are those kind of signs inside the team that might be there be careful there might be a cross there so be very careful and stay away from wearing clothings uh, like that which is haram are you also allowed to wear clothing that has bismillah rahman rahim on it or allahu akbar which is very common in the new day fashion, they sell that for Muslims, hoodies especially. That has Bismillah Rahman Rahim on it or things like that. It is haram for a person to wear clothing that has what? Bismillah Rahman Rahim, ayat from the Quran or Allah's name, anything in Allah's name on it. It's haram because what will happen later is when you take it off, what do you do? You throw it, you wash it, you, you, you sweat inside it. So Allah's name should not be degraded like that. We should stay away from it.